All right, guys, Jay here. I just wanted to go over the uh, mailbox pick. Uh, we're going to be picking the C9100, you know, Compex, run-of-the-mill uh, mailbox lock. This is what you see, well I, well, I see in the majority of mailboxes that I run into these days, besides the old stuff, of course. Um, we're going to run this with the newer Lishi 1646. This is a pick end decoder. I have it set up here in my vise on the bench. I can insert this. When you insert this, you want to make sure that you're in the number one spot all the way up high. If you come down, your lifter is going to be in the way. So get it all the way up in the number one spot. Insert it. Make sure it's all the way in. Slight turning pressure. I'm going to start with one. One is rigid. We're going to pick it. Two. Bouncing. Three. Bouncing. Four. Is rigid. We're going to pick that. Just bring it down so that you get the click. Now you're bouncing. Five. Rigid. Bring it down. You got your click. Come back through. Four is bouncing. Three is bouncing. Two is rigid. Bring that down. One. Three is now rigid. Bring it down. And there you go. Now that your lock is picked, we can run a quick decode on this. Cut one. Be a three. Two. There's two. Three. There's two. Four is a three. And five is a four. You cut your key, you know, whatever you cut your codes on. And uh, you'd have a perfect working key. I've used this several times now, and it works absolutely flawless on the mailboxes. Appreciate your time. If you like this, subscribe, and we'll do some more.